Yo. Whew. Man, exciting things have happened this week. Well, I didn't know, but it was Mardi Gras, and oh my gosh. I went down to San Diego and just got wild. As soon as I got off the train, there was people selling beads. It was $25 is what I paid for 90 beads. I was like, woo! Put them on, I was about to go out. I couldn't, I couldn't wait, man. I was like, I'm going. And so basically I took the train all the way down there. My boy ditched me. He ditched me, man. He was down there with this girl and he almost got in a fight with somebody or some stupid thing. And he ended up going back while I was going down there. So I was like, you know what? I'm still going. I'm still going. And I took off, went all the way down there and I got there and had the beads and everything. Got to the first club, went into the first club, man, man, whew. The first club was hype, was hype. As soon as I got there, this girl was like, can I get some beads? I was like, you know what you're gonna have to do for the beads, there's no, there's no way you're just gonna get some beads for free tonight. She was like, boom, I was like, woo, man. Took off a little hand stack, probably like, you know, like four or five of them, gave them to her, and then, you know, surfed around the club a little, spent, I, I bought two drinks at the at the at the bar. It was seventeen dollars for two drinks, and all it was is, is a vodka and cranberry. That's all it was, and, and it took so long to get up to the bar because there was like a zillion people in there. Whenever whenever I first got in there, I went out to leave, and there were so many people, so many people that oh my gosh, I couldn't even leave. They they said, oh the downstairs is open. Go get down there and there's no one there, man. There's no one there. And then people start piling in, piling in, piling in. I was like, man, there's drinks at the bar. Boom, boom, slamming them back, getting all messed up, getting hype, you know. And then there's girls walked in. I was like, oh, what up, what up? You know what I mean? In their face. And then it's, it just got to a point where I got really drunk. And then I started bumping into people. Like, like I was walking and like they are like walk past me. And I was like, boom, you know what I mean? I was like, ah, oh, you know what I mean? I was like, oh, in her face. Like, dude, you can't stop me, bro. I'm a beast, bro. I'll, I'll shake you through this club right now. You know, it was it was super, super hilarious, like, that night, dude. And basically, I had to run from the club all the way to the, to the train station because I thought this one building was the train station and it was just something that looked like it was the train station, but it was not the train station. So I had to run all the way to the train station and there it was. It, it, it was there and I finally got there. It was like five minutes before the thing was going to leave. I was like, whoo! And basically, I get there. Now, don't, now don't, don't just look at me like, oh my gosh, this guy right here. Now, I, 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 I had a little little badge. I showed them that, you know, I, I can get on for free. And they seen it. Said okay. And I put it in my pocket and I go to get uh, something out of my pocket and my weed falls out and hits the ground. And she looks down at it and the cop, this is a cop, and looks down at it and she says, what's that? Looks back up. And I just reach down, grab it, and put it in my pocket, and then just walked on the train. She didn't say nothing else, nothing else. Could you believe that? If this was Phoenix, I'd have been in jail, in jail for some. Oh my gosh! You know what I mean? So Mardi Gras was super fun. I got the I got the video. I, sh I, I I shot the video. My phone says you need more memory, so I started deleting everything. And then I took I tried to take more video, and it said you still need space. So I was like, I'd probably take a better video than that, anyways. So I deleted it, and it still said the same thing. And I still could not record. I couldn't believe it. So I missed out, and that's what the webisode would have been. But now you're just seeing me talk right now. <laughs> Which, okay, I'm sorry, you know what I mean? I should have just brought my camera, the one I'm filming on right now. That would have been so much more better. But hey, I'm on my way today to San Diego. It's a Jersey Shore theme. My hair is on point. I didn't know, but hey, it's the last moment thing. I'm about to go do my thing, and I'll tell you about it next week. Have a good one. Peace.